Hi, today we're going to demonstrate the HFA 250W. This is a 2011. This is serial number 6505908. We just got done rebuilding it. This has got a lot of new parts and it's ready to go. It's programmable. We got a brand new coolant pump. We've gone through and checked the lines, replaced a lot. We've got new, brand new uh, pulley set underneath the guards here. And we just go through and repair everything. We got bearings in the rollers. Bearings, bearings, bearings. All new bearings in the guide arms. So we're gonna start off by showing the auto touch off feature. And what you do is you push this little button here. Now that we've pushed that, it touches the material touched up against the vise closed. Backing up, and now it knows where the front of the material is. Doesn't know how wide it is. Okay, now what? Oh, and it feeds forward on its own. If you can't see it, it moves forward, then it moves back a little. So now, it'll take a crop cut and remove a minimum amount of material. So you don't waste your material. All right, go ahead and cut. We just got in a piece of uh, steel tubing. We're just going to hand spray some coolant on there. At cool right 2290. Guaranteed that the smell the last twice as long as the present coolant. Twenty two ninety has a uh, built in uh, birth control for bacteria and fungus fungus. All other uh, coolants buy that product and very caustic and hazardous to your skin and lungs. Where uh, this patented product is uh, unique to cool life twenty cool life products. Enough about the coolant. Here we go. Get the old blade. Good. We got a new blade in there. We're going slow because it's a brand new blade and we got to break it in. You can see it's perfectly fine. We've also measured it and adjusted it. So it's cutting short off and length. So factory on these are plus or minus two thousand per vertical inch of cut, plus or minus four thousand on the feed length, five from the factory. We're at four. As far as top to bottom, we're probably out a thou or two. This is generally half of the new factory tolerance. There are a lot of variables in the man saw the blade, off factory cutting. There you go. We didn't put more than one part in there. Nice quiet hydraulics. What else you want to see? We got the piping for the nesting clamps if you want. And an option you can get from Omada. Oh, we fabricated a new cover for the hydraulic system here. Just keeps the chips out. Nice diamond plate. All right, and here's the control panel. That's the one crop cut feature right there. There's your screen. A little scratched up, but easy enough to read. Okay, thanks for viewing.